we all have one group of friends that are easy going, easily pleased and love to do things that are tried and tested. They find happiness in the trivial things in life and do not love to experiment much. To some people, this group may look slow and ponderous, but believe me, when they have their eyes set on a specific thing, they have an exceptional endurance and strength. Hi all, this is Dr. Amala and in today's session, we are discussing about this group of people, the Kapha Prakriti people. Having a predominance of Prithvi and Jala Mahabhuta, this group of people is endowed with a strong sense of love, courage, stamina, dedication, determination, forgiveness and stability. And as I already mentioned, once they have their goal fixed it, slowly and patiently but with finacity, they pursue this goal till they find the fruitful results. Endowed with the robust, well-proportioned body, these people have a very big tendency to put on weight easily, though they do not lose it that easily. They have smooth, shiny, clear skin, strong and lustrous hair, beautiful nails, deep pleasant voice and intact joints. When it comes to passion, eating tops the list and that add on to their tendency for putting weight. Though endowed with a well-proportioned body, the Kapha Prakriti people are not blessed with a strong digestive system. They need to boost their metabolism by consuming food that are warm, more with the flavor of bitter and pungent that aids the easy digestion and absorption and not increasing their Kapha any further. These people value their inner tranquility, peace and harmony and is an absolute joy to spend your time with. But what happens when their Kapha gets imbalanced? They become inflexible and withdraws from their radius of existence. They find these changes exhausting and it makes them shut themselves off and become isolated both emotionally and spiritually. And when they become isolated, the first thing they resort for comfort is eating. And that too, they would like to indulge in high calorie food, which has a greater tendency to make them overweight. This is one of the reasons why the Kapha Prakriti people tends to become overweight lifelong. To keep the Kapha Prakriti people in balance, you need to constantly encourage and motivate them to have a systematic lifestyle, eat healthy and be aware of the things that they eat. So, a consciously active lifestyle with the awareness of the food they eat is very much essential to keep your kapha in check. And the most important thing that the kapha people should keep at bay is excessive sleep and sedentary lifestyle. They have a tendency to sleep during the daytime and almost all free time that they get. So, please don't do that. Indulge yourself in small activities that will keep you active and maintain your health properly. So with this, we come to the end of the Prakriti series. Understanding your Prakriti is very much essential. We all know we are unique in different ways. What makes us unique? It is your Prakriti. And also, it is your Prakriti that determines the diseases you might get, the way your body reacts to certain things. So take a moment, understand your Prakriti, understand the things which suits your Prakriti and which harms your Prakriti. Indulge yourself in the things which suits it and please abstain from doing things which is harming your prakriti, making you get susceptible to various diseases. So, understand your prakriti, live a healthy life. From the next video, I'll be starting off two series. One is based on the immunity because all of us are concerned about the present health conditions and we all want to stay safe from this COVID-19. So, a better understanding of immunity is the need of the art. Also, because of this COVID, all of us are confined into our homes, though there are relaxations now. But due to this confined lifestyle, a lot of health issues and beauty issues are also at hand. So in the next simultaneous two series, one series will be solely dedicated to ensure how you can have your immune system working properly. And the next one is how you can combat the cosmetic issues that you have found now recently because of this confinement. Stay tuned for these two series. Till then, it's bye from Dr. Amala. Thank you.